So I just posted a video the other day talking about phone link and how well integrated that is into the OnePlus Open. And one of the best features, I would say, of phone link when it is truly integrated into the OS like it is with the OnePlus Open is the ability to cast your phone screen wirelessly to your computer. But there's one big problem with that. As of Android 14, you have this box pop up that asks you to allow this to happen each time. And this can be very annoying because it means you start the casting on your PC, you have to interact with your phone every single time. But apparently there is a workaround to this. So we're going to jump into the Google Play Store. We're going to search for this app, App Ops Permission Manager. And let's go ahead and install that now. On this first screen here, we're going to use Shizuku mode. Not exactly sure if that's the right pronunciation, but that is uh, what I'm going to go with. So let's go ahead and download that. It'll take us to the Play Store where we can go ahead and get that done as well. Now inside the Shizuku app, there is a command that needs to be run within ADB. Now I'm not going to show the process of getting ADB up and running in this video. I will link in the description another video that was regarding the OnePlus Open that shows that entire portion of this step. So if you don't know how to do that, refer to that video and then come back here. I will put the command in the description down below so it's easier for you to copy and paste. We're going to run that command in just a moment. We're going to have success here. So we should be good to go. And in fact, the screen on my phone has changed. But as you can see here, we have a thing. You need to take an extra step. So let's see what we need to do here. Let's click on read help. Disable permission monitoring in developer options is what it says here for Oppo and OnePlus. So let's go home. Let's go to our settings and then down here to additional settings and then developer options, which you should have already enabled in order to be doing this. And here we go, almost to the very bottom, disable permission monitoring. Let's toggle that. And now let's go back to Shizuku. Let's close this. And I think, yes, indeed, we are now running. Now keep in mind, you got to keep this phone plugged into your computer while you are doing this. But we can now jump back over to App Ops. You're going to have a thing pop up to ask you if you want to give it permission to use Shizuku all the time. I actually already did this and I did not realize that I was not recording. So at that point, once you give it permission, this is the screen that you're going to be on. Let's just quickly search for Link to Windows, select that, and let's scroll down here until you see Project Media. Click on that and change it from Ignore to allow, you see where mine is on allow now, that's what's gonna make this thing actually work. And at that point, we should be absolutely good to go. And I can prove this, I'm gonna close the screen there quickly. Let's bring phone link back up. I'm gonna unplug from my computer. And this is the screen that I usually like live stream with cause like the chat's in that blank corner down there, but it'll work fine for this as well. Let's just go home actually. And I'm gonna click on the screen. You can see it up here and watch what's gonna happen. It just starts casting. It absolutely works just fine. Now, there is a caveat with this, right? So some of you may be thinking, oh, I'm just going to like leave my phone in my pocket and I'll just cast from it. That doesn't work that way. The phone actually has to be unlocked for this to work. It's not going to unlock your phone for you. Another thing is it would only give you the vertical screen that might be a bit annoying. What you're going to want to do is have it unlocked and maybe just sitting on like a stand in front of you or something. I do this all the time. I keep my screen off at like 30 minutes because I do this a lot. I just leave it sitting in front of me and sometimes I'm doing stuff. I'll interact with my phone, keep doing stuff. Well, that's going to basically augment this and make it that much easier because you can just do this and it instantly pops up with you not having to reach out and interact with your phone. So again, doesn't solve every problem, but it definitely does solve a lot of problems, I think, or at least one big problem. So guys, if that was a hurdle that you needed to have jumped, there you go. Hopefully that does it for you. Like I said, I'll put that command in the description down below, as well as a link to an earlier video. Like I said, I'll put that command in the description down below as well as a link to an earlier video that kind of explains the developer options ADB stuff as well. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more. Until next time, stay nerdy, my friends.